Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Shauna, Shauna the MUA, and it's been a minute, but I am back with a new video. Um, today I'll be trying out the new Glow Wish. This is by Huda Beauty, and this is the Blur Jam. So this was one of their new releases, and then I'm also going to be um, trying out, of course, their new Empowered palette. And this is what it looks like. So before we get into this review and a quick little makeup session, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification bell so that you know when I upload here. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Shauna the MUA, and TikTok, Shauna the MUA. Let's get into it. So this isn't my first time trying out the um the Blur Jam. I actually tried this out a few times um, since I've gotten it. I say that it's awesome. Like the way that it blurs the skin, it looks so good. So um, it says to keep this closed, this little um, thing here, keep it sealed for freshness. I will say that it has a cooling effect. So I'm just going to take a piece of it and I am going to rub this all over my face I am going to let it sit on my face so that it can just set in I am going to use the makeup forever this is the HD foundation this is in 4y60 so going to mix it with um, the Lancome and that's just because I'm a little bit more tan on my body you want to go in a padding motion as you can see I have that on now this is my foundation and this is the side without so I'm going to complete my full face and I'm going to be right back that way um, you can see how the foundation is with my concealer set with powder and then we'll get right into the eyes be right back Alright guys, so I've already put on my face, I put on um, my blush, I put on highlighter, I use majority Huda Beauty um, products, I use the setting, the setting powder, the Easy Bake and Blondie, I use the two concealers, so I used um, Praline, Praline and uh, Peanut Butter in the concealer. Um, I use the Juvia's Place bronzer. This one is in um, tan, so I use tan as a bronzer. Um, and then I just use I use a Huda Beauty brow brow pencil, which I haven't used in a while. So since this is all Huda Beauty, um, this is number seven black brown that I use for my brows. And then I use the Juvia's Place um, eye prep eye prime um, as a base. So now, let's get into this palette. So as you can see, these are the shades. It's such a beautiful palette. Like, it's very fall. Um, it has a lot of, like, warm tones. There is a lot of, like, orange or peachy shades in here and copper tones. Go in with uh, Get It, which is the shade right here so we're gonna use get it in our crease it is I'm using a 224 from I mean yeah a 224 from Mac now I'm going to go in with legacy which is this shade right here it's like a burnt copper so I'm going to use that now in my crease I kind of want to use the gray just to see something a little cool tone. I don't know if I'm going to jack this up if I do that. Um, but I kind of want to use winter. I'm just going to put that in the outer crease and kind of just blend that. 
I know I'm kind of mixing cool tone with like warm tone, but you know, I'm just trying to experiment here with this palette. So I'm kind of just using winter in the outer section and bringing it into my crease a little bit just to give a little smoky effect. I'm gonna go in with Bold Moves, which is this shade right here. I'm gonna use my finger. It feels, look at that. Look at that pigment. Like, come on, huh? And I am going to press that onto my lid. When I tell you Huda did not come to play with the pigment, she did not come to play. Um, I was trying to see if I could mix it, but you know what? I think I'm going to just keep this shade just because I have a little photo shoot that I'm going to. Um, and I don't want to be too coppery because I'm wearing blue. So to kind of intensify that gray, I am putting a little bit of Confident, which is a brown. Alright, I did smoke out underneath the um underneath my lash line with um the gray. So I use winter and I use confident just to smoke out underneath my eye. I like to use the gel liner um because I think it's easier. I don't really do wing liner as much on myself. Mascara, this one's a kush. I'm gonna use the head of beauty. This one is the lifeline I wanted duo. So it has like the liquid liner and then the other one. I'm just going to line my waterline. Lash, SLR Beauty. You can find my lashes online at slrbeauty.com. Um, I am using my style in Queen. So this is Queen. But this lash is for my girls that don't want all those lashes. <laughs> so far, this is the look. Um, I am going to use, so I don't really have any Hedda Beauty uh, lip products, so I'm just going to use the Dose of Colors. This is a collab with Makeup Shayla, and I am going to use this. Um, this lip liner is just She's Ready. That's the name, She's Ready. This pencil glides on so smooth. It's just super skinny. It's super skinny, which I'm not really used to. I'm going to use the Dose of Colors. This one is Final Touch. This is also from the Shayla Collab. So I put it on. Lip kit from Shayla. So this one is the gloss. This is the final look. So you guys, my final thoughts. You need this palette. Like if you don't have it, like this is fall. This is what fall is. It's copper tones, you got the smoky effect, so you could do a smoky eye. Um, you have very pigmented glitters. So manifest it, it this one right here, I don't know if you could really tell, but it has like a weird texture to it. And I say that because it's actually a very nice color. I'm going to do multiple looks with this palette. It's just because I have to be somewhere and I can't really do anything crazy right now. So these are definitely everyday colors. We have the Glowish. 
if you have oily skin you need this now I'm wearing it a couple times I will say that it definitely smooths out the skin and it blurs now as far as the mattifying and if you have oily skin I would say typically I still see a little oiliness like around my nose area um, it's not as ours um, but overall I love this collection I love the new palette I love the glow wish and I only need that you definitely need the set of beauty palette um, I believe it's probably like 65 I think it's like $65 um, is it worth it yeah I think it's worth it and you need this primer I just like the blurring effect of it like it, it's not totally mattifying like I said but you need the primer <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Um, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Um, you know, I'm looking to gain some subscribers because I need to be back on this platform. So if you're not following me on Instagram, follow me there as well. Bye, guys.